Hey guys, it's me Kat. Before I let you go, I just wanted to share with you a few of my summer essentials that I've been loving this season. So first up are these amazing shoes. I'm holding them quite awkwardly, but I've been loving shoes with um, the ankle strap detail, and I think a lot of girls are. I've just been seeing so many cute chic looks with this, and if you paid attention to my feet in the video, you would notice that I pretty much wear it up, wear, wore more a pair of shoes um, with an ankle strap in almost every outfit, if not every outfit. So I've really been liking those, and I found a really great deal on Call It Spring for super affordable ones like this. These ones are, first of all, very easy to walk in because they're wedges. If you're really girly and feminine and you want that really sexy silhouette, you might not like the wedges too much. I do think it looks a little bit clunky um, slash boring, but they're really easy to walk in. And the strap is just super cute, and I really do believe this was only $30. And then the one pair that I did decide to spring for from Aldo were these, which I wore for my 24th birthday. And they're just really cute. These were expensive. These were 90 but I've just been loving all of them, and I feel like it's made, it's made me look more ladylike. Um, so that's one. Next up, where's my hat? One second. Next up, I finally delved into the hat craze. I feel like it's going to look crazy right now. It looks a lot better with like wavy hair too, by the way. Do I look like Amelia Bedelia or something right now? Probably. Maybe if I make my hair more jaunty looking. Come on. Mm -hmm. This is better, guys. Okay, it looks really cray now, but um, I really liked this hat when I first um, spotted it at Brandy Melville, and I spotted the gray one. They have both, they have both or the store I had one, two, had both, um, a gray one and a black one, and I really liked the gray one. My friend told me not to get it, but I felt in my heart and soul like there was a connection there, and it actually didn't make me look crazy. Um, although now, from the viewfinder, I feel like it's looking a little meh, but also I let it kind of be crumpled, like just sitting under something on my bed, so I hope it hasn't changed the shape permanently, but everyone has one of these like floppy felt hats, you know, I've seen amazing beautiful YouTubers Instagramming with them, and my own cousin Hannah, who has a few amazing cute pictures on Instagram wearing the hat, I'm not sure if she has a video, but I will link her down below so you can take a peek, and now I own one, so it just makes me feel more grown up, ladylike, kind of like I'm at the Kentucky Derby, but still. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Oh, so we did the shoes, the hat. Um, I want to show you. I'm going to go get it. One second. Okay, sorry. I just fixed my hair because I want some consistency throughout this video. But I found my perfect summer bag at Aldo a couple months ago, and I really love it. It was originally $90, which Aldo's just going out of their mind trying to sell stuff at that price. It's pretty bad because when you go into Aldo, you'll notice that, like, literally like there's like six shelves just the sale stuff so I was lucky enough to wait on it and it got reduced to $57 and or something like that and then I think there was another sale that took a little bit more off it and so I bought it for $57 and my friend had actually given me a $50 Aldo gift card which really me uh, meant that I only spent $7 so yeah um, so this is my just go-to travel summer bag it's so cute it would work with basically anything and it's just it's really nice. It's got these nice gold finishes, and I don't like the leopard too much inside, but still, it's really cute. And also, you can expand it, and it's already unzippered, but if you want to make more room, you can expand it. I'm just zippering it back up so you can see it gets skinnier. But yeah, my last favorite, um, I guess, are pieces like this. Summery pieces, like really simple, sleek slip dresses, you know, crop tops, halter tops, just great basics that you can put under drapey sweaters. And I've been thinking that I want to do a video on different ways you could style drapey sweaters, and I have amazing sweaters I want to show you. One second. Okay, so to tempt you, since we are basically in September anyway, and I feel terrible that I'm putting this lookbook out so late, I just want to show you a few of the amazing sweaters I want to style. Here's this one, which I tried at two different Urban Outfitters locations. And I absolutely fell in love with how this looked. It looks so cute, even with like summer attire. I'm talking like high-waisted shorts and tank. It still looks perfect. Um, so this is from Urban. This one is from Forever, and I got it a few months ago, and it's so super cute. I just love the silhouette of it. This one I bought well over a year ago, and you've seen it in my fall styling 10 fall staples or essentials video. That was before, you know, the fall, fall 2013. And it's from American Apparel, and it's just great. My mom absolutely hates how it looks. She says I look like 
It's like an oversized bat or something, but whatever, I like it. And then this, which is a new purchase from Granny Melville, take a look at the texture and the pattern. Isn't it absolutely stunning? I fell in love with it the second I saw it, but it looks truly ridiculous on because it's just too long. And the sleeves, it kind of makes me look like I don't even know how to say it. It's a beautiful sweater, but it definitely needs to be tailored to make it look, you know, to make it meet the vision that I have for it, because it looks a little silly right now. But anyway, guys, that's it. Those are my summer loves. I also want to put in a quick picture of a look that I had planned on putting in my lookbook, but it just got too long. I've really been loving skater dresses, and I had hauled a whole bunch of Forever 21 skater dresses, and I'll put the haul where I found those down below, but this pink one is one of my favorites because Anyway guys, um, thanks a lot. Please like this video if you liked it and you know what to do. Um, comment, rate, subscribe. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!